Think back to the first time you encountered the magnetic presence of Elizabeth Taylor on screen. Maybe it was on a lazy Sunday afternoon, flipping through channels, when her captivating gaze and undeniable talent stopped you dead in your tracks. Or perhaps it was a family movie night, gathered around the TV, as her iconic performances painted vivid memories in your mind. Elizabeth Taylor, a name that resonates across generations, a Hollywood legend whose impact was etched into the fabric of cinematic history. Now, let's dive into some lesser-known aspects of this remarkable woman's life, shedding light on the person beyond the silver screen. Delve into random facts about her journey, her passions, and her influence that stretch far beyond the glitz and glamour of Hollywood. From her unexpected hobbies to her philanthropic endeavors, Elizabeth Taylor's story is a tapestry woven with threads of talent, resilience, and unapologetic authenticity. So, let's embark on a journey to uncover these hidden gems about a woman who left an indelible mark on entertainment and beyond. Elizabeth Taylor, the million-dollar actress and a groundbreaking milestone for Hollywood, Elizabeth Taylor secured her place in history as the first actress to earn a staggering $1 million for a single movie role. Her commanding performance in Cleopatra not only showcased her unparalleled talent, but also marked a turning point in the industry's approach to compensating its leading stars. Taylor's portrayal of the iconic Egyptian queen demanded both artistic prowess and a commitment to the grandeur of the production, which famously encountered numerous setbacks during filming. Her persistence paid off as her historic paycheck not only shattered records, but also laid the groundwork for future generations of leading actresses to command their worth. This milestone not only underscored Taylor's star power, but also reflected the shifting dynamics of gender and compensation in the entertainment business. Beyond the financial accolades, her performance in Cleopatra remains etched in cinematic history, a testament to her enduring legacy as an actress of unparalleled caliber. Elizabeth Taylor's achievement resonates to this day, serving as a reminder of her indelible impact on both the art of film and the advancement of gender equality within the industry. In 1969, Richard Burton bought her one of the world's largest and most exquisite diamonds, a symbol of their passionate love story. Elizabeth Taylor, renowned for her timeless beauty and cinematic prowess, became the proud owner of the dazzling 69-carat Taylor Burton diamond. This extravagant gift not only epitomized their opulent lifestyle, but also solidified their status as one of Hollywood's most iconic couples. The diamond's sheer size and flawless cut captivated the world, much like Taylor herself. The gem's journey to her finger was accompanied by a whirlwind of fascination and envy. As they graced red carpets in premieres, Taylor's finger adorned with the diamond stole the spotlight, leaving the world in awe. The tale of the Taylor Burton diamond adds yet another chapter to Elizabeth Taylor's legacy, a narrative punctuated by extraordinary events and extraordinary jewels. From her brilliant performances to her tempestuous romances, Taylor remains a symbol of Hollywood's allure, and the Taylor Burton diamond stands as a testament to the grandeur that defined her life. Elizabeth Taylor's storied friendship with Montgomery Clift, a glimpse into Hollywood bonds in the glittering realm of Hollywood's golden era, few friendships shone as brightly as that of Elizabeth Taylor and Montgomery Clift. Their camaraderie, forged on the silver screen and nourished by shared passions, weathered the tides of fame and adversity until Clift's untimely death in 1966. Meeting during the filming of A Place in the Sun, Taylor and Clift's connection transcended their roles. Their shared dedication to their craft and mutual empathy cultivated a deep bond that withstood the demanding industry they inhabited. Both talented beyond measure, Taylor's luminous beauty found its counterpart in Clift's intense vulnerability, creating a chemistry that resonated on screen and off. But it was the tragic circumstances surrounding Clift's accident in 1956 that tested their friendship's mettle. Following a car crash that severely disfigured Clift's face, Taylor rushed to his side, providing unwavering support during his arduous recovery. Her loyalty underscored the genuine affection they held for each other. While the acclaimed actress was known for her opulent lifestyle and illustrious marriages, her connection with Clift was grounded in sincerity, a rare gem amid Hollywood's glitz. As Taylor navigated tumultuous relationships and the public's unwavering gaze, her bond with Clift remained a steadfast source of solace. 
In an industry characterized by transitory relationships, Taylor and Cliff's enduring connection reminds us of the profound connections that can flourish under the spotlight. Even after Clift's tragic passing, Taylor's anecdotes about their camaraderie continued to echo, offering a glimpse into a friendship that transcended fame and time. Elizabeth Taylor's dazzling journey from Africa to Hollywood's heart in 1967. Amidst the lens flash and whispers of Hollywood intrigue, Elizabeth Taylor embarked on a unique voyage that took her from the glitz of Tinseltown to the depths of Africa's Dahomey. Taylor, celebrated for her unmatched beauty and acting prowess, was in the midst of shooting the comedians alongside her tempestuous love, Richard Burton. Their African odyssey was no ordinary jaunt. It was a window into Taylor's adventurous spirit and her commitment to her craft. As the cameras rolled and the African landscape unfolded, Taylor's magnetic presence shared the screen with Burton, creating a cinematic experience that would be etched into the annals of Hollywood history. But Taylor's allure wasn't confined to faraway lands. Her personal life was a stage of its own. Enter Eddie Fisher, her fourth husband, who famously quipped that a mere $50,000 diamond could keep the tempestuous Taylor content. It was a nod to the extravagance that became synonymous with Taylor, whose relationships, wealth, and taste for opulence were as prominent as her on-screen performances. As the world watched, Taylor's journey unfolded like a multi-act play, replete with drama, elegance, and grace. While the highest-rated episode of a popular TV series might remain elusive, it pales in comparison to the vibrant tapestry that was Elizabeth Taylor's life. In the end, the glittering diamonds and the far-flung adventures were but facets of a woman who defied convention and shone with an unparalleled brilliance, both on and off the silver screen. Elizabeth Taylor, unveiling untold stories in the glittering tapestry of Hollywood's history, few stars shine as brilliantly as Elizabeth Taylor. Her life, filled with love, scandals, and triumphs, remains an enigma that continues to captivate. Amid her many intriguing narratives, one revelation stands out, casting a new light on her relationships. In the 1979 memoir Brando for Breakfast, Elizabeth Taylor's ex-wife Anna Kashfi offered an intimate glimpse into the actress' tumultuous romantic life. Kashfi's candid words painted a portrait of Taylor's complex emotional landscape, where the lines between love and ambition often blurred. While Taylor's passions burned on the silver screen, her personal life became fodder for headlines. However, amidst the tales of love affairs, one name stands out, Bessie Mee. When Taylor faced a near-fatal car accident, Bessie Mee became a central figure in her journey to recovery. This cryptic moniker held a story of resilience and camaraderie that transcended the glamorous facade of Hollywood. As the world watched, Taylor's strength and determination emerged as testaments to her indomitable spirit. In a rare 2007 interview with Mary Hart of Entertainment Tonight, Elizabeth Taylor pulled back yet another curtain, revealing a decades-long silence broken. The interview marked a poignant reunion, as Taylor shared that she had recently reconnected with ex-husband Eddie Fisher after nearly 40 years. This unexpected conversation laid bare the intricacies of Taylor's emotional landscape, where time and fame couldn't erase the memories that once intertwined their lives. Elizabeth Taylor's life remains a puzzle of triumphs and tribulations, love and heartbreak. Her connections, both public and private, continue to captivate the imagination, offering a glimpse into the humanity behind the star. With each revelation, the portrait of Taylor becomes richer and more complex, reminding the world that even icons are woven Years from later, threads of the vulnerability and from strength. And Elizabeth Taylor found herself in a position that few could relate to, parting with an object that had become not only a stunning piece of jewelry, but also a part of her personal narrative. The auctioning of the iconic 69. 42 carat diamond, famously known as the Taylor Burton Diamond, marked a significant chapter in her life. Mined by De Beers, the gem had been extracted from the depths of the earth, carrying with it a history that spanned millions of years. Its transformation from a rough stone to a mesmerizing jewel was a testament to human craftsmanship and the marvels of nature. The intricate process of shaping the diamond was entrusted to none other than the renowned Harry Winston, a name synonymous with luxury and refinement. 
With meticulous precision, Winston and his team worked tirelessly to reveal the diamond's inner radiance, ensuring that every facet captured and refracted light in a breathtaking dance. As the diamond's surfaces were polished to perfection, it seemed as though they held the secrets of time itself within their sparkling depths. In 1979, the diamond emerged once again into the spotlight, this time in an extravagant display of opulence and grandeur. The anticipation surrounding the auction was palpable, as collectors and enthusiasts from around the world eagerly awaited the chance to possess a piece of both history and Hollywood allure. When the gavel finally fell, the price reached a staggering $5 million, a sum that resonated far beyond its monetary value. It was a testament to Elizabeth Taylor's indelible mark on popular culture, her unparalleled allure, and her enduring connection to the world of exquisite jewels. The Taylor Burton Diamond's journey from the depths of the earth to the glamorous auction house encapsulated the essence of timeless elegance. It was a symbol of more than just material wealth. It embodied the stories and emotions that can be woven into objects, transcending generations. As it changed hands and adorned new owners, its allure only deepened, a shimmering reminder of the past, present, and future. In a world where trends come and go, the Taylor Burton Diamond remained an enduring icon, an everlasting embodiment of beauty and luxury. Elizabeth Taylor's legacy, intertwined with the radiant gem, continued to captivate hearts and imaginations, reminding us that some stories are meant to be written in gemstones, etching their brilliance into the tapestry of time. Years have passed, but the mystique of the Taylor Burton diamond remains undiminished. Its facets continue to reflect the light of an era long gone, preserving the enchantment that Elizabeth Taylor herself once exuded. A sparkling testament to the interplay of human artistry and nature's wonders, this dazzling gem still continues to grace conversations and spark dreams, forever a symbol of timeless elegance and Hollywood glamour. And so, the story of the Taylor Burton diamond persists, etched into history as a luminous thread in the narrative of both a legendary actress and the world of precious gems. As we bid adieu to this exploration of Elizabeth Taylor's remarkable journey through the world of entertainment, I encourage you to pause and delve into the tapestry of memories she has woven into our lives. Like threads of a complex narrative, her performances have intertwined with our own experiences, evoking emotions that are uniquely ours. Whether you found solace in her elegance, inspiration in her resilience, or simply reveled in her magnetic presence, Elizabeth Taylor's legacy is an invitation to introspect and celebrate the enduring power of artistry. What moments of hers have etched themselves into your heart? Was it her iconic roles that resonated with you, or perhaps a lesser-known gem that struck a chord? Share your cherished recollections and thoughts, for in this collective sharing, we breathe life into her cinematic journey once more. In her portrayals, Elizabeth Taylor mirrored humanity's vast spectrum of emotions, proving that the silver screen can be a mirror to our own joys, struggles, and transformations. She embodied characters who felt palpably real, making indelible imprints on generations past and those yet to come. With grace, she danced through various genres, leaving behind a mosaic of performances that continue to dazzle and provoke thought. As we take our leave from this contemplation, I extend my deepest gratitude to you for embarking on this voyage through Elizabeth Taylor's legacy. Your time and interest are invaluable, for they are what keeps the luminous tales of remarkable individuals alive in our collective consciousness. May the impact of Elizabeth Taylor's artistry continue to ripple through time, a testament to the enduring magic of the silver screen. So, dear reader, I invite you to share your reflections, to celebrate the tapestry of Elizabeth Taylor's career woven into our cultural fabric. Thank you for your presence, your thoughts, and your engagement. Until our next cinematic exploration, be well, be inspired, and keep the legacy of art alive.